That's how wicked black folks is. These people over here trying to stop me and the baby from getting something to eat. That's how wicked black folks, black people is. No, I'm just saying, that's how wicked they are to where you will try to stop a pregnant woman from getting food. Like, that shit is so evil. And then the reason why you doing it, you trying to cover up somebody's pregnancy and then gonna try to stop me from having food. The nerve of black people. When God said that I was not considered black because I was light-skinned but not light enough to be considered light-skinned, I was like, okay, I understand. But these wicked black folk, from all the way, this whole restaurant, I mean, all the restaurants down there to all the restaurants down there, know that I'm with child, and they feel like, oh, because Andrea being done wrong by the system, and because they done tried to kill her baby and it's still alive in her, we could just starve her. We could just close the restaurants on her in the dining areas and then try to help the white people hurt her baby. Oh, just because the white people wanted to kill her in the jail, we can just throw her out of the shelter with a baby in her, and then we could just set the baby up to be killed because the white people don't want the baby to survive, because the white people don't want to give her back her son and threaten to rape her baby. Oh, we could just close the dining areas and starve her and the baby and try to kill her baby. And that's sad, bro. That is so fucking sad. And it's like, y'all have no fucking backbone at all. And then sitting over there trying to fight me because the doctors uh, won't tell the truth that I'm pregnant. Um, and because they don't want to tell the truth about all the people that's been abusing me with this baby in me. And then got my family and everybody thinking, oh, we're going to sit around and paint her out to be crazy for standing up for herself and for telling the truth that she's pregnant and for proving that she's pregnant and for telling the truth that everybody trying to kill her baby. We're going to sit here and close the restaurants down on her. That is so fucking wicked, bro. Then we're going to sit here and keep watching her screaming on social media and laughing and shit. Um, that's why I said, man, everybody is wicked in this country, bro. Everybody is wicked, and they leaving me outside so that they can watch me tell that they over here trying to kill my baby and my body. And I am so sick of this shit, bro. I'm sick of every fucking body. And then they steady looking at my stomach, like uh, steady looking at my stomach and trying to kill it and lie and say that I'm not pregnant. And this is why I don't like white women at all, because for them to be sitting over here trying to let the whole country lie, you don't own shit. You don't own the world. Yes, my baby is still alive. Yes, they got everybody in the country trying to kill my baby, including black men and black women, thinking that white women got all the power, thinking that the white man got all the power, thinking that these devils got all the power they gonna run up behind Hispanic people that want to see your sister baby dead. Think you gonna run up behind Asian people that want to see your baby dead. Think they gonna run up, black people think they gonna run up behind white people that want to see my baby dead in my body knowing that my baby's still alive and that I got the right over my body to say that I want medical care. Knowing these racist ass people is lying in this hospital and saying that Andrea is not pregnant because they don't want to do right by us and they don't want to tell the truth that Austin a white man was abusing a pregnant woman and got shot. So they over here trying to kill the baby in her body for three years, trying to starve her and torture her, took a little boy and threatened to rape him. But all the black people is over there trying to set her up to be murdered and kill the baby in her body that God said wasn't going to die. And then leave her outside to act like uh, a black woman ain't got time to protect herself and her child. And then they talking about they don't care that Jesus Christ is on the black woman's side. They don't care that Jesus Christ done kept the baby alive. They over here talking about, oh, we want to go to hell with these white folks. And we want to tor uh, torment your pregnancy. And we want to terrorize and kill that baby and you and then lie about it because we worshiping these white people. And we're going to sit over here and let them get away with saying they're going to rape your baby because we worshiping these white people. And we're going to leave you outside and try to stop you from getting in touch with anybody and try to make you look crazy outside by yourself trying to set you up to be killed and trying to set your little boy up to be raped and sodomized by nasty white homosexuals and then we think we're gonna run around with these white folks and be famous.